Well, this is really positively jacked. The First Book YMCA teaming up with Channel 4 this weekend to make sure that your kids are safe around the water this summer. Stories about children drowning are some of the toughest we cover. That's why this summer, Channel 4 and our local YMCAs want to make sure you have the skills to swim. Join us at any YMCA pool this weekend for a free event to get you or your child's skill level tested by swim experts. If you pass, you get to ring this bell. If you need extra help, there are programs in place to help. Go to the community page on News for Jacks for more information. Safety around water, it's everyone's responsibility. You know, we talk to you folks at home a lot uh, about, you know, children that, that wind up uh, these tragic stories where kids mm -hmm. drowned. So joining us to tell us how you can get your child free swim tests and maybe lessons is Charlie Chacos. He is the executive director at the Williams Family YMCA. Uh, yeah, thank thanks. you for coming in. I, I know that this, you guys have a, a really big goal between now and the end of the year. How many how many kids do you want to reach? We do. We're trying to reach 5,000 kids to get, come in and get free swim tests. Um, what we do at the Y is we've got a safety around water program, and it's, it's a real core initiative initiative of ours. Jacksonville, you've got, you know, the oceans, lakes, rivers, and we really want to be able to make sure that kids are safe around those. So what this does is it helps them if they are in a situation, they're able to roll over, float, maybe kick to get to safety. Uh, you know, since you guys teach these skills, I can only imagine how much it, it, it impacts you when you see one of these tragic stories, because sure. this is the very thing that can prevent that. So what happens this weekend when the kids come out? Sure. So this weekend, we're thrilled. We're partnering with Channel 4, and so we're going to have joy out at the Williams Y this weekend taking some live shots. But really what we're doing is we're opening our doors and we want the community to come in. So bring your kids, bring, parents, if you don't know how to swim, come and get Take a swim test, right? Come and get a swim test. And really, we at the YMCA, we don't feel like, you know, learning how to swim is a luxury. We really feel like it's a necessity, especially for, you know, Jacksonville residents in, in the state of Florida. So what's, what do you have to complete to pass the swim test? Sure, so the swim test, what we, what we ask, is swim the length of the pool and be able to tread water for 30 seconds. So that's it. We've got a band system. So if you pass, you get a green band. It's kind of like a necklace. And you get to ring the bell. And you get to ring it's the got bell. Channel 4 on the front and the Y on the back for Absolutely. our partnership. I love it. Okay. Yeah. And, you know, if you need some work and you're not able to pass the test, we do have an array of services, you know. So we've got parent classes where you can get in with your six-month-old. We've got swim starters classes where you're really learning the basics. My daughter, Sloan, who's seven years old, is, is taking stroke development, really trying to fine tune her strokes. And so we've got programs for every age, you know, and again, the adults, if you never learned how to grow or how to swim growing up, come out, check us out. We've got private lessons and everything. Well, this so. is the other thing too, is that maybe if you can't afford to get lessons, um, you might qualify for free lessons. Absolutely. So we're a nonprofit and I, and I, and I want to make this clear that we're here to help serve the community. And so we've got these fantastic advisory boards that help us raise money to give back and reinvest in the community. And so a lot of the dollars that we raise go to these signature programs like the Safety Around Water. Right, what, if, what if you can't get there this weekend? Can you still come out and get the test? Absolutely. I mean, if you're, if, if you're in the Mandarin area, come see me, yep. uh, Charlie Chacos. I mean, <laughs> ask, ask, ask for him by name. But, um, you know, it, it, it doesn't matter if you can't make We want you to come out this weekend. If you, if you come out next, the weekend after, Ask for myself, we'll get you set up. Again, this is a, a real core initiative of ours, and we want to make sure that we're saving lives and keeping people safe. And like you said, it's just as important that adults get tested too. Absolutely. You know, sometimes it's generational. So if your parents didn't swim growing up, then maybe you didn't pass that on. And we're trying to break that cycle. Again, we're trying to keep kids safe and, and you know, save lives. Now, is this just at the Williams YMCA this weekend, or is it all across the board? It's all across Jacksonville. So up from Fernandina Beach down to St. Augustine. I mean, out at the Brooks Y down here on the river yep. at, at Winston um, over in Clay County. We'll be all over. All Ponte over. Vedra. Yep. All right. So depending on where you live, head to your Y this weekend. Get that Absolutely. swim test. Maybe it's you. Maybe it's your kids. And a free swim weekend kicks off today. It's going to run through Sunday. And once again, though, you and your child can get tested all summer long. And join News for Jack's anchor Joy Purdy tomorrow starting at 9 a.m. at the Williams YMCA on San Jose Boulevard. Bring your family there. And if you missed any of this or you want to check uh, for the free swim weekend locations, go to newsforjacks.com community.